It's a trap. Fuck. The beast is coming. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Run, motherfucker, I'm holding the run button. Okay guys, hopefully this works. This is Hellblade part eight. And uh right now we just did the tree, we've got the sword out the tree, and now what we're gonna go and do is we're gonna go through the gates which we have unlocked by going to the tree and coming out the end of the I believe it was the Sea of Corpses it was called, so here we go. Okay, we've got another door to get through here as well. Okay, cool, we've got like a cave, cavern area inside this mountain. Okay, so Helheim. I will tell you of a great hero named Sigurd, son of Sigmund, no less. Born after his father's death, Sigurd is cared for by the dwarf, Rain. But Rain does not love the boy. Instead, he plans to use him for his own ends. You see, Rain's father possessed a great treasure given to him by the gods. But Rain's brother, Fafner, killed his father and took the gold all for himself. Fafner hid the treasure out on a heath and could not leave it. And from the evil in his heart, he turned into a dark creature. A dragon. So does that mean we're going to have to fight a dragon? There we go. Like, I did think we were going to fight more um, kind of bosses than we have. Something's behind the door. What is it? She can feel it. No. Don't open the door. Don't go in. Don't open the door. A great beast guards Helheim. Garm is its name, and it knows you are here, Senua. It can smell your stink. What are you afraid of, Senua? How would you say Dillion if you are too much of a coward to step into the shadow? They can't stop me. Then do it. Okay, shit. Keep running. Keep running. The beast is stalking you from the shadows. Your sword is useless here. Okay, so not to be dumb here, but I've already forgot which way we just came from. So. We weren't running towards that, so it's either this way. Okay, I'm gonna say we're going forward. Maybe we're gonna go this way, okay, ready? So three, two, one. Okay, well that was lucky that was in there. And that it didn't burn. No, it's a trick. Mother, do you hear that? Don't fall for it. It's me, Senua. It's so loud. It's not her. It's so full of hate. I just want to help them. Tell me what to do. Your father wants them to go away, and he only hurts me to silence them. But he's gone now. But he always come back. He says I will die. If In I'm terms of like integrating they live action people me. into games, we've come a long way since like oh, the night trap and stuff Stop. like that. Stop! That's why they crawl through the walls. Don't Do you them. see them? <laughs> Do you see their faces? <gasps> he's coming! Send you And it, it works Help me! Well, so. Help! Get me out of here! And it makes sense if it's like a bit uncanny because they're meant to be like visions and shit, so it, it does work. She shouldn't be here. She escaped the darkness. Okay, so we need. She, she took her own life to escape it. She can't remember when it started. When her mother lost her smile. Her eyes gazing past her towards a world she could not see. We can magically do it by not even touching it, so that's impressive. This is what happens if you reach um. for the underworld, he said. 
Okay, so obviously we need to go around the back of that door to it open it a little bit more. It was not taken for a child. And the first time she felt the cold chill. So we can go up as fear. well. That's kind of cool. I don't talk much about her father. Zinbel. I suppose I just didn't want to risk upsetting her. But it doesn't matter now, does it? So basically I'm just going to light every um, torch point that I see. So hopefully that will help in some way. Like, so I feel like we're going to lose the torch at some point. So as long as we have a decent amount of um, light, then that's, that, that's good. This kind of segment thing reminds me of uh, Alien 3. Just watch that like the other week. Like there's a bit at the end where there's like a, a maze and shit like that. Um, and they have to like lure the alien to the it's like the smelting chamber kind of thing. Uh, but it's got like the kind of like central alleyway like that. Oh. Lightsaber now, cool shit. Oh fuck. Get away from them, get away. Okay, now we can attack that guy. Take the torch and move. You can't go anywhere okay. without your light. Take the torch and move. So light this little thing here. Okay, another one. I'm just gonna light everyone. Do you think you can slip away from the shadows if you light the torch? That was close. There. We got knocked down. Like I don't, I don't really know how that system works. Like you get knocked down. And then it's like they're gonna kill you, but sometimes they don't. So it's just kind of luck. I was kind of like spy maybe button, and sometimes she gets up, and sometimes uh, she doesn't. So I guess that was no really helpful. Okay. So actually, hang on. Can we? Sometimes you have to be in certain spots for the letters to appear. But now there's no like red letters this time, so I guess we better carry on and go back this way. So we have three symbols to do. So far we have none, and nothing's really jumping out to me. I don't think we've been this way. Okay, that's the door, so we have been this way. There was like a, a random torch, so I'm going to see if there's any help from looking at that, like this one here. But I can't seem to see any real use of that at the moment. I'll go back this way because I think to the left here there was a, another cave to look down. Okay, so that one's barred. 
basically any door that's there is pretty much useless. And you can just assume that it's got a um, a bar on the other side. Okay, so let's try this thing, because we saw it before but we never used it. So if we go up here... My torch is going out. No, it's not. She hasn't got much time. Burn out. She's too slow. It's not going to burn out. The darkness will come again. go down as well. Because there's water there, so it looks like it'll go out if we go in. Because this game is a bit thick. I guess I trying to light that one up there, but it didn't work. Okay, there's a little alleyway over here. Still nothing's really jumping out to me yet. Okay, but we have unlocked the door. This, um great thing here reminds me of the 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 covering for the the troll pit in Brothers when you have to get the troll to run into his chains and then the big brother pulls it oh my god why didn't I notice that you have it Okay, we've got one, so let's try going down the spiral stairs. Because we went up it to get here before. Symbols are pointless. They're meaningless. You mother's What are you doing when there's nothing behind the door? Say it, Dillian. This is just another trial. It's just another trick. Just to distract her from her real. The graphics look good, like the lighting and everything looks really nice here. Okay, see that's going to extinguish our thing. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. There we go. See that was weird, like, like strobe lights, like it's a roller coaster or something. She'll have to go under. She can't. She has to. She Could you not like, try and like twist it around the... Bars. Okay. The light's shit. gone out. Run, run, get through it as quick as you can. The panic is here. There we go. Okay, this is stressful. I just realized you got like hair like um, she belongs in like battlefield here. Is this bit simple enough? You have to rest here on the side. Oh fuck, I was like, oh cool, we can light that torch, we don't have a torch anymore, do we? Yeah. Uh... Uh... Okay, that looks like a law stone. But I don't want to risk it and go over there. And maybe we can. If we can get a. Um, Torch. Okay, they're good. There's one in here. So we can go and get it and then bring it back. Okay, yeah, we don't have to run anymore, actually, do we? It is pretty lucky that there was a torch here, though, to be fair. 
You should have just um, gone through it. Yeah, I thought it was. You could see the circle through the, the dark. Rain the dwarfs. I think the so contrast is dark on like the capture that is my actual like TV, so. And he uses Sigurd to reclaim it. He tells Sigurd the story of Fafnir's gold, and the good-hearted hero promises to slay the dragon if Rain would forge a strong sword. How deep for him. is this? Sigurd remembers that his father once possessed a sword given to him by Odin. Odin broke the sword to bring about Sigmund's death, but Sigurd's mother still has the pieces. And so Rain reforges the That's cool. This place. It reminds her of the isolating, suffocating darkness that she lived through as a young girl. Imprisoned in her room at night. The faces in the dark coming through the walls. So I'm going to check how many we have. She once thought in everyone could see them. Area, which I is hard them. because the. That's what children say all the time. Isn't it? it looks like. That there are monsters. Four. It looks like in four more. In By the time she realized that, that only that she could see them. Her father. We only have one them. more area after this, so that's quite cool. We're getting to the end. It felt like it was going to take forever at the start, but in the last few parts, it's kind of. I think we've got our rhythm going and it hasn't been too bad actually, so. Because after the Val Raven thing, that was an absolute disaster. Okay, so we have two waves to go here. So that's just like a, uh, a door, and there we have a law stone. Oh, cool, we're, like, we're right next to the door, that's cool. The dragon Fafner is so large and deadly that it would be impossible to kill him face to face. But each day, Fafner crawls across the heath to find the other. So Sigurd digs a pit in the dragon's path and lies in wait in it. When Fafner slithers overhead, Sigurd sinks his sword into the dragon up to the hilt. Sigurd leaps from the pit and Fafner sees his killer. He warns Sigurd that the treasure will lead to his death, as it led to the death of all who owned it. Sigurd replies that death comes to all men, and every man would want to be wealthy until that day. And he takes the treasure. So what I'm just checking now is that when there was like the red letters here, is that it was for the rock thing on the other side. Because it looks like it is, but it's not coming back. Okay, cool. So now we have the. Um, I'm trying to think how you describe it. Kind of like the the kite with legs. So I guess we just have to keep. Look at that. So you can. I've noticed how you can kind of like clip through the wall sometimes, like the camera. Look at that. <laughs> Again. Cool. Um, okay, I guess just more wondering about trying to find stuff. Then. So this is the way we went down. I think. Or is this a different one? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one we, we just did. So if we go up here and... Hmm. I think we already, we already went up, didn't we? Oh yeah, because that's where we got the P. We push these over. Okay, now it's got a chain on it. Never mind. Go away. I'm 
that brings us to the middle bit, so let's try going left here. See if that helps him. Actually, this might be where we fought them guys in the first place. I have no sense of direction, so... Okay, no, we're just going to get brought back out. Yeah, yes we are. So this is like the first kind of area room we came in. But I'm wondering if they might have hidden some letters in here. Well, the letter we've got left in here, at least. But it doesn't seem like it. Just trying to think where we haven't been. Right, let's go left here. Oh, I kind of recognise that pillar thing. Okay, we haven't seen this. Oh wait, no, we have. We've been here. This is okay. So this is the. Okay, look. Now it's here. Okay, why was not there before? Unless we had to leave and come back again. There we go. We got it. There it is. You have all the rooms. <laughs> The beast is crawling into your mind, searching for weakness. It found your mother, and used her to trap you in here. Did you see her die? I don't remember. I was only five. They told me she escaped the darkness, that she's with the gods. But what if they lied? What if the darkness took her and trapped her here? Okay, hey, sorry about that. There was like some commotion going on, and I had to go see what's going on. There. Cool. Um, so yeah, we just did the rune. It's a trap. Fuck. The beast is coming. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Run, motherfucker! I'm holding the run button. Um. Uh. Okay, I'm trying to. That just really fucking caught me off guard. in the one pine for Dillion. Do you remember that darkness, Senua? The beast is bringing it back. Mother, mother, mother. Why did you leave me? Spreading. Father's keeping me away from the others. Away from Tilly. I won't give up. 
I'm not going to rot in here. I'm going to find doing. Okay, so I'm not sure how this is going to go, but I've had issues with the recording stuff, I've had issues with the game capture stuff, so hopefully we'll be able to actually finish the game. And right there I was worried that I'd like glitched it because I had to exit during the cutscene because it was going all uh, screen teary and laggy and unusable basically. And when it dropped me back in, all the letters on the door were in red that time. So I was like, oh shit, I've totally messed this up. Now I'm going to have to redo the whole the beast is down there. thing again, because I thought I was going to be like, glitched there. Like, I thought I'd like soft locked it. But, no, all I had to do was um, interact with the door and I was fine. So that was a great relief. So here we are carrying on. So thank God for that. So, oh, hang on. Hmm. So if that's not the right way, what the hell are you going to do? Unless you can... Okay, there's things to the left there. I literally saw it when I came in, and I just ignored it. That was good. Okay, that was lucky. I, I keep forgetting the controls, even though it's like only half an hour between each time I use it. So like there when it was coming at me I was trying to press X to um like evade even though it's A. So it was lucky that it actually got hit. Finish this! End it now! Okay, we've got another one. Okay shit, that was not a good start. So hopefully you can dispatch with him quickly. I think your um I think when you focus your sword may have more power as well. Behind you! Like when it's um blue like that. Okay, that was lucky. Fuck, fuck no. Please, come on. Get up quick! Okay, so I, I, that was weird. I like the thing you did, but I couldn't use it because it's still on the ground. Okay, good. He's dead, and that's it. That's it. Okay, good. Shit, that was close. I thought I going to pick it up. Alright, it can't be that far away. Surely. I was hoping that was just going to like cast a shadow. 
and I could just do it straight away, but I guess not. So maybe we have to go through here and look at it. Oh no, it just makes it out of the wood, okay. Alright, I thought I triggered it, but I apparently I haven't, so. So let's run over here. Duck under here. Right, there's a flame behind us, so ready? Let's go. We just have to run. Come on. Go. Go. Oh, there, there. Oh, oh yeah, she's still got the torch as well, so. He was doing his best. That's lucky. Never, ever listen. He was trying to save her from the darkness. Zimbel was right. Zimbel was trying to save her from the darkness. Alright, so we've got to be careful here. These are kind of... I haven't died on one yet, but I feel like it's only a matter of time, which is why I'm just taking it as slow as possible. Okay, there we go. Okay, this is a weird, like, kind of prison-y area. Okay, cool, we've got, like, crucifixions down here, and we have a little stone. <gasps> this one's very fancy. Although Sigurd kills the dragon, Rian wants so to keep Fafnir's gold. Two left Sigurd in this area. Rian wants to keep Fafnir's gold all for himself. Which means that we're nearly at the end of this Rian section. Also wants the and wisdom of the which would suggest so that we're almost blood and asks the, Sigurd to nearly Fafnir's to the last level. So that's pretty Sigurd cool. So. But when he so yeah, I saw it like last night, and I thought it was going to be like a super duper long kind of like thing. He licks his okay, this area is pretty cool. The dragon's blood. So we have another and door here. He understands the language of birds and hears them talk nearby. So we need an X. The lights run out. She'll die. She has to do. Alright, so that's one. So we have to get up there. <laughs> Which I don't like the look of. So, oh. Holy shit, we actually almost get. We've got everyone. Like, how fucking lucky am I that I went back and the. Uh, after the first thing, I was, I was kind of like ruled it off. But, um, now I'm I'm glad that I took the time to go back and look. So, but now this is like super stress me out. Is there a way to kind of? Why does it do that? It goes so dark you can't even like see the. He kills Rian, eats Fafnir's roasted heart, and takes Fafnir's treasure. And he embarks on a new quest to so ride to Hinderfell back the other way. and find Brynhild. He's going to try and have a look at that. To ride Hinderfell and find Brynhild, the Valkyrie. Okay, this looks promising. Okay, cool, we have a torch thing. What's she doing? She's lighting a torch. Oh. She's making light. She's making a fire. She's got oh. light on the other side. She'll be safe. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time, I've got to run. But if he's behind us. Okay, is it behind us or is it just So so obviously I've got to go around Go on, there you go. Obviously I've got to go around this way. And then from the other side, go and push the bridge down. Oh, if I push the bridge down and then run across it, then I'll be in the fire. Okay, I was thinking I had to run back to the to, to that one there next to the. 
the strut, which isn't very efficient. But that's me, I like to do things the hard way, apparently. So three, two, one, go. Oh, that's fucking creepy. Stop. Oh, the... Get up. Wow. What are you doing? I thought I'd, I thought I died there, but it was. Oh, that's creepy. Like the face is flashing up and shit. That's awful. I'm so Stop. happy this bit came down. Although it, it might, although it'll probably continue after this door, so that's not much use either. Where is she going? Faster, faster. See how quickly I solved that puzzle compared to earlier on where I didn't know what the hell I was doing. So I'm, I'm pleased with that kind of progress. And Where is she aim at it. Faster, and there we are. And there it is, and there it is open. So let me just have a look at this. So I have one left. So I either missed one, or it's behind here. So hopefully it's behind here, fingers crossed. Ooh, this is cool. Brilliant. Swirly tunnel. Oh yeah, and we lost the skull, so when we think of him. The tender guiding. And there we go. So black. I was gonna say I wonder if we have to find the skull now. Well. She convinced herself that there was nothing beyond its reach. How little separates us from what we fear. No fear would ever reach her. But like me, Sigurd is fearless and passes through the flames just as I did. He rakes the sleeping warrior girl. She teaches him the secret wisdom of runes, namely victory runes, ship runes, runes for persuasion, runes for truth, runes for healing and help, runes for perception and power. Like Sigurd, the greatest young warrior of the north, you must learn the secrets of the runes to fight amongst the gods in hell. Okay, I thought I really thought the torch was gonna go out there. Oh fuck. That's horrible. Oh. Come on, Senua. Do you hear me? I hear you. Come back to me, Senua. I'm coming for you. I'm coming. Gets a sword out, that means that we're gonna have to have a fight. No! You betrayed your god. I am leaving with him! You turn your back on me. That is why Dillion is not in hell. Be working. Fuck, what the fuck? How am I do this? Jesus Christ. Well, that was a good hit. I got a good gun on that. Get up. 
No, fuck, we're dead. Oh, okay, I'm not sure if that's three or four deaths we've had. Okay, actually, it's still not going up like that high. Okay, so maybe we can't even actually hit him, so we just have to dodge until... Thing. How do I get past it last time? Just kept dodging and hoping that it would work out. Okay, last time it didn't last as long, so I don't know why we're like stuck here. Oh, okay, we use the focus here, of course. Come on, Senua. Come on. This is what fucked us last time. Find him. Doing like a dark souls fight. Not that I've ever really played that. But... <gasps> yes, yes, yes. <sighs> Fuck! This stresses me out so much. People think of evil as an unnatural, invisible force, and so invoke the gods for protection. But evil can come from the hand behind the gods. A familiar hand, cold and cruel. He tried to fix her with his rituals, kept her trapped in that hole. She couldn't say which was worse. The darkness. Or the monster that her father had become. She couldn't fight them both. And so she left. Headed for the one ray of light that shone down on her. If she had stayed, she wouldn't have survived. Maybe Delian would still be alive. I'm so sorry, my love. She will save his soul. Even if this time, she can't save her own. Forgive me, Senua. I know you have no reason to trust me anymore. But believe this, it was my mission to make you hate. To hate the darkness with a passion so great it would focus your mind on this quest. time I've wanted to protect you from the truth that would have destroyed you a long time ago. But you have conquered your darkness at every turn. You deserve to see behind the veil of darkness. And take me to the master to trust you as deep as we can go. I won't stand in your way. 
You will not survive what is in there. I know. What else can she do? Nothing. She doesn't want to tell us. She has nothing. She has nothing. She's come this Okay, she so with the, the hell demon this. thing defeated, uh, I'll leave. I, I, I think this is going to be the last area, section, whatever you want to call it. So, um, that should make for a good final part, as long as I can do it like efficiently and not run around like a headless chicken. So that'll be it for part, I don't even know what part we're on at this point, like seven, eight. Um, so yeah, we covered a lot of ground that part, so that was really good. So yeah, that was Hel Helheim, I think, the mountain. So yeah, I don't know what we're waiting for here. Maybe we'll find uh, the redemption that she's been looking for and she'll save Dillion's soul. So you have to come back next time to find out. Uh, but in the meantime, thanks for watching, stay awesome. And I'll see you guys next time for the conclusion of Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. Thanks a lot.